Hey, I want to talk about a problem you might find with search results. You might have like the widget on your page, you click it, you do a search for say an item, like say Ninja. And what happens is the results doesn't just bring back products or um, posts as well, because that might be what you're using it for to bring back posts and products. It starts to bring back pages as well. So if I got a page that's called Ninja, it brings that back. But not only that, it might also start to bring back things like checkout and cart as well. Look, because in a way you see it might be that uh, it's cached the word ninja or it's just got it in its interface somewhere. OK, I don't need to see cart and checkout or ninja page. I don't mind ninja post. I don't mind the products either. But how do I stop the pages? This is actually really, really simple to do. Now, for anyone that's not aware of how you create a search results page, what you want to do is go over to templates. OK, you do add new. You then select uh, search results down here. Give it a name. Now, when you do create it, um, I tend to use the archive posts. You can use archive products as well. But if you want this to be a mixture of posts and products, and you're going to have to go for the archive posts one or just have archive posts if it's just posts and there's no product. But remember, you do also have the widget for archive products if you just want to have that. But let's say we've got archive posts. OK, if we go to display conditions down here at the moment, this is currently set to be showing us the search results. And I've even said exclude the post archive, but it's still pulling it through. So we've got search results here at the moment. OK, now. The way to stop it bringing back pages is to add in a code snippet. That's all you've got to do. Let's go over to our plugin over here. Now, by the way, um, code snippets is free. Uh, it's a plugin you can get from the WordPress repository code snippets. It's totally free and it's one of my go to tools. If you want to add in any Java scripting or any special type of code, but you're a little bit worried about doing a child theme or Messing around with your functions and stuff like that. I don't like to do that, so I prefer code snippets. So I've got a few on here already. So we're going to add one in and we're going to call this one Stop Pages in Results. Now we're going to drop in the code and this will be in the description for you or a link to it. Now this bit is quite key, okay? What you'll notice down here is that it is now going to be restricting the search results, but here we have query set post type array. Now, if you're only going to want to show posts and you're not going to show products either, get rid of the word array and get rid of this bit here. OK, and that closing bracket as well. There's no need for the array. But what I'm doing is I'm saying in the search result, only give me post and product. Don't give me pages. OK, so just post and product. We save the changes. And if you haven't already, you would have the button here that says activate. Let me just show you if I deactivate it. Just hit activate. By the way, though, um, if um, there is ever an error in your code, you'll get a warning from code snippets and won't run and your website is totally protected. So don't worry about that at all. Right. So we've now activated that. If we go back over to our page over here, remember, though, in here, all I've done is dropped in the product archive, not the product archive, sorry, the post archive. And all I've done is a bit of styling. I haven't done anything else to it. Let's now do a search for Ninja again. OK, remember, we were getting the cart, the checkout and the ninja page. Well, look, now we get the products and you will down here get the ninja post because there was one ninja post. But the ninja page is now no longer there. Look, it's, it's not there. It's not even hidden by pagination. The cart and checkout is gone. So if in your search results you are getting like pages coming through and you don't want that because of naming conventions, Maybe if you search for Imran, if my name is somewhere, it might pop through on a page as well. I don't want that. I just want post and products. This is what you do. So add this code snippet in and, and you're, you're done. I hope you like, subscribe, share and follow and I'll keep seeing you. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame, there's no time, feel the pain, with the grind, I could change, in my mind, pick a lane, commit and climb, the only way, to win it life, I never miss that fact, taking big swings, bitch, hand me the bat, put me in the ring.